What's up everyone? My name is Rogi and welcome back to Subnautica. As you can tell, yes, we are in the process of moving for this one. Um, I went some offline hunting and started looking on the internet of where to find the ice stalks and I scoured for them for quite a little while. I found one. So, knowing where the sea crown seed is, which is in the containment facility, the easiest place to find it because we were there were a lot of them around. Um, we are going to have everything we need to hatch those eggs. Oh boy. Oh, she wants them hatched? Why not? Let's let them hatch. What's. It's not like anything bad's gonna happen, right? It's not gonna be the end of the world or anything, right? No, let's, let's stay positive. I was headed to the uh, life pod because I didn't have to race. So I wonder, do we create the blueprint of the enzymes? I swear to God, those were moving. Um, do we make the enzymes at... The, uh, our base here, or do we make them in the portal, or, you know, in the containment facility? Well, one way to find out. Yeah, let's put you on the charger. Let's take everything out. We have everything needed for the enzyme. Mm, yeah, no, we gotta, I think we gotta put it in there. Which doesn't bother me. Oh. Oh! Oh, yeah, we do, oh, we don't have, uh, okay, yeah, so we have to make it here first. I don't think anything's going to happen to us with everything that we have, so let's just take the seam off, let's go to where the gun is, let's hop in that portal, go back, go back out, return, jeez man, we're going to be all over the place. You know, hold on, I, I'm kind of thinking about something. Is there a possibility I could build something inside? You know what, no, let's just go with what the original plan was. Let's repair this thing, and let's get on to hatching her young. Just gotta make sure I'm going the right direction of the gun, that's all. Yep, we are. I wonder, can we bring our Seamoth through the portal? Haha, <laughs> that'd be awesome if we, you know what, we're gonna try it. Let's see if we could bring the seam off in it. Warning. Maximum depth <gasps> reached. Hold no! No, seam off, don't. Oh, shit! We gotta bring it out. We gotta bring it out. Well, you can. That's a good thing, but no! My Seamoth isn't taking any damage. What? What happens if I get back in it? Welcome aboard, Captain. My Seamoth isn't taking any damage. What? I, you know what? I'm not arguing with it. We're going to go get that sea crown. We're going to, hopefully our Seamoth doesn't explode by the time we get back. Oh my god, I can't believe that. Holy shit. That's insane. Just gotta... I know I found... saw the, uh... I know we saw the sea crown somewhere around here. 
Oh, wait, wait. Yep, there it is right there. All right. We have everything needed to make the enzyme. We're going to head back to base. We're going to probably do the same thing we did here, but I have a feeling the Seamoth is just going to explode when we get out. Because this is insane. I've never seen this happen before. Wow. Warning. Maximum depth reached. Hull damage imminent. That's insane. I, I don't see how it was protected in there. I'm... I've... Why, I, I'm still shocked that my Seamoth survived all that. Just being in 1,500 meters of water, that should just kill it. We're going to be making the enzyme. We're going to hopefully get something out of this. Uh, I think she said something about, like, the cure or something. I, I, I don't know. I, I can't remember. But I'm just, I'm honestly surprised our Seamoth lived through that. We now have the hatching enzymes. We are going to go back. We're going to leave our sea moth outside the portal this time. Just because it's not going to happen twice. All systems online. You know, let's put the sea moth in here. In the dock right here. Whoosh! Fucking A, I hit it. Kind of got my job. <laughs> Kind of scared me for a second, honestly. back. Time to give her babies the hatching enzymes. My young are swimming for the shallows. I thank you. Their freedom is my end. What will it be like, I wonder, to go to sleep and never wake up? Perhaps next we meet, I will be an ocean current, carrying seas to a new land. Or a creature so small, it sees the gaps between the grains of sand. Farewell. One heck of a, uh, ooh, what's this? One heck of a, uh, ending right there. I'm actually getting a little bit teary-eyed because that's, uh, it's amazing to see a, uh, creature like that hold off for so long and have her young and just save the last bits of her strength for her young. I have a feeling we're cured.
Uh, look, we see him here too. That is awesome. And they're delivering the hatching. Oh my, we gotta go get air, but we're gonna watch these. Can we scan them? Oh, we can. Come here. Come here, little one. I want to scan you before I run out of a... Uh... There we go. Thirty seconds. Let's see what... Th so they're just spitting out the uh, enzymes to help. That is awesome. That is really cool. All right, we're we're gonna go and we're gonna see if we could do anything to this gun now. I don't want to be poked with that thing. Ooh. Is it off? Oh, this is gonna hurt. <gasps> is the gun off? Babies are no longer here. We gotta see this. Holy shit, it's off and it's pointed right at us. Not to not gonna lie, that is kinda freaky to see. Oh wow. You know what? You wanna know what it's time to build? It's time to build that fucking rocket and get the hell off this place. Just gotta find our uh, our mobile vehicle bay platform, which should be right over the base, and see what it takes. There it is. Okay, so the, for the platform, four lead, two titanium ingots, and a computer chip. You know, I have a feeling we should go back and get our uh, prawn suit because it does have a, a lot of the silver on it that uh, I've never taken out. Where's the base? Yeah, see, look at the prawn suit. It's all the way down there. <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna make the how much what type how much silver do you make? No, it doesn't make any silver at all. Okay, cool. We got copper wire, we got gold, we should have table coils as well. Lithium, but yeah, we got we got a couple things of lead. All right, we're saved on that. Sweet. Oh wait, we got more lead here. Kutu, kutu, kutu. What was? Don't don't even ask what I was trying to say. I I don't know. 
copper, lead. We got more lead. You know, let's bring out all the lead that we have because I have a feeling we're gonna need it. Or not. Uh, we got gold. Oh, all right. All right, time for the computer chip, I think. Maybe. What were we missing? Oh. Do I really have to go in and get table coral as well? I may have to. All right. Oop, didn't want to do that. Oh, wait, hey, table coral right here. Sweet. And then we just need... Let's bring out the lead, too. And silver, you never know what we're going to need for all the other things. And we need gold, table coral, lead. Yeah, we should have everything. No, copper wire. I just got to remember where the last other copper wire was. If not, I'll just make more. I mean, it's not like we don't have two copper right here. Alright, now we just need a plate silk ingots, which is 10 um, titanium, which is going to be kind of easy to get. I just got to put all this stuff away. Let's put all the way to the health kits. We don't need it. Well, so, well you know what? We're going to send the floaters on their way because we don't need the uh, floaters anymore. Go after that speed fish. Not my Seamoth! Said... Go after the spade fish! You wink. <laughs> oh no! We. <laughs> oh, that's horrible. The spade fish doesn't know what to do. Spade fish! Oh no. How many can we attach it? Is he gonna go? He's going up now! Oh, that's so sad. Spade fish! No, he's just going straight up in the air. Spadefish doesn't know what to do. <laughs> okay. Um. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here comes the first part. That's a big launch V that's a big launch pad. Holy cow. Damn. Look at this. Holy shit. Wow, this is going to take a lot at all. Copper wire, lube, and plate steel ingots. Well, we know what we need to do for plate steel ingots. For some reason, my glasses always get fogged up, messed up, touched, and I don't even, I don't even touch my lenses. But yet, they're still there. Hmm, much better. So, plate still ingot, copper wire, and lube again. I'm kind of wishing we had our bronze suit right now because copper is a great resource that we could use. But I'm pretty sure I'll be able to find a lot of it. Um, so, yeah, more. See, if I also had my bronze suit, I could get titanium that I desperately need. Son of a bitch. You know, if I could find out where one of those uh, portals were, we'd be able to bring back the uh, prom suit by itself. Maybe. I'll think about that one. No, 
I'm kind of curious. Since we've cured the planet, will the uh, warpers be after us and attack us like before? Or will there be no more? Here we go, everyone. We're starting to build our rocket. I'm so happy we have nickel. <laughs> I'm really happy we have nickel. Plate still ingot, aerogel. Oh shit, do we have any more rubies? Uh oh. Wait, no, we got lots of rubies. Do we have any more gel sacks? Uh oh. <laughs> and this is at times where we need the prawn suit. Oh shit. Alright, well, I guess we're gonna have to go back and get our, uh, our prawn suit. Get it back up here with the cyclops and everything. Can't avoid it. Oh well. I see there are the rubies. And there are the gel sacks too. So we can make one arrow gel right now. And then we need plate still ingots, so we have to go through all that again. Alright, well, since we need to get our Cyclops back, I was going to turn this into a whole long thing for us building the rocket and finally getting out of here, but that's not going to happen right now. So, with that being said, join me next time to where we are going to finish building the rocket and we are going to get the fuck off this planet. Thank you guys so much for joining. I'll see you next time.